What are you doing? There's hairs on my face and I'm scratching them off with my fan. It's multi-purpose. My AC is broken and it's 85% humidity outside. And it's like 85 degrees in here, so. Do the math. Oh, another year, another VidCon missed. Welcome everybody to my channel. My name is Jeremy. And I'm Jake. Today, or whenever this video gets posted a couple days ago, maybe yesterday, big announcement from RuPaul's Drag Race. RuPaul's Drag Race All-Stars 2 is going to be a real thing now. That was, n there was no need for the shade fan. So the rumors on the internet is that Alaska is confirmed, Ginger is probably going to be there, Lagange is probably going to be there, Kennedy for sure is not, it's not going to be in teams, and there was something else, but it wasn't that important to So today, we are going to give our speculative... What is that word? Speculative... Wish list, if you will. Here is who we would like to see on RuPaul's Drag Race. All-Star Season 2! I built my entire list on the premise of teams, and the rumor is that there will be no teams, which is... A little upsetting to me because I really like the team aspect of All Stars 1. So I think it'd be like really cool to see teams again. I didn't like the teams, and okay. we discussed this earlier. Being on a team with another queen got some queens further than they should have because of who they were teamed with. I love Chanel. I don't think she would have gotten as far as she did if it had not been for Chad, and I think she brought Chad dangerously close to getting eliminated too many times. And I also think it did bring some queens down who could have gone farther, like Pandora. The only exception would be, I think Raven and Jujube were perfectly evenly matched, and I think that's why they are such a dynamic duo, because it's not a matter of strengths and weaknesses, it's just strengths and strengths that complement each other. So, I'm not upset that the teams are not going to be a part of it. It's I, just speculation. It's speculation. not proven yet. The tape, it won't even start being filmed until September-ish. I don't feel like it's fair though that the first set of All-Stars had to go through the whole team thing and the second set of All-Stars don't because then, the, I don't know. I don't think it's fair that the first set of season one girls had to go through that rinky-dinky little tiny stage <laughs> and then Vaseline filter and season two onward just got bigger and better. But the world that we live in is cruel. And then Bibi Sahara Benet got like $25,000 and so did Tyra. She got a nickel and a pair of new shoes. On to who we would like to be on the Our show. Our dream cast. From season one, I'd like to see Victoria Porkchop Parker. There's rumors that she's going to be in it. Uh, I hope so. She's really the only one at this point that I would like to see because Tammy and Chanel had their chance. Um, and Nina. Nina had her chance. I would really like to see Porkchop as well and I would really like to see Angina. Oh, I yeah, Angina. live for Angina. I forget she's a thing. Yes, Angina. Those are, that's it. Angina and Victoria from season one. From season two. I would like to see Morgan McMichaels. I feel like she has stayed relevant without Drag Race. Like, she has kept her head above water purely by the skin of her lady bits because She's working seven days a week. She's fierce. She's funny. I've seen her live several she's so times. Fierce. She is amazing. And she's grown so much since Drag Race. I would love to see what her she... Her ass has grown, you Her mean. ass has grown. I would love to see what Morgan could bring to All-Stars this time. She would be like the Raven of All-Stars 2. I would like to see Tatiana. I, I almost want to see Mystique back to she's grown a lot she's grown a lot in her drag and I would not be offended if she was in all-stars too I really want Morgan Tatiana and Jessica Wilde because I oh, think Jessica Wilde Jessica should have been Wilde. in the first all-stars but I'm also not bothered that it was Pandora Juju and Raven like if we were gonna have anybody for the first one it should have been those three but I feel like Jessica. Jessica is such a fierce performer and she's so fun Jessica would be fun too. So definitely Morgan, definitely Tati. For me, if it's either uh, Jessica or um, um, 
Mystique, I would be good. From season three. I would really, really like to see Mariah because I think Mariah is <gasps> oh, super yes. fucking fierce. Mariah, Pena I would Valencia. live for Delta. Yes. And sorry about it. I would like to see Shangela come back. Hallelujah! Third time's a charm. You know what's funny? I actually was thinking they should bring Shanji back for. Somebody tweeted as soon as they tweeted about All Stars Two coming back. Somebody tweeted Shangela with the gif of her jumping out of the box. Hallelujah! And it was like at RuPaul hashtag All Stars Two at Shangela. I, I would love to see Delta. Yes. I would love to see Delta. Whoa! Well, and Delta made a guest appearance in the first All Stars as a boy. As a boy. As Gabriel. But I think it was just they didn't get to have everybody they wanted to in the first time around because they just didn't know how it would do, so they didn't really have the budget yeah. for it, you know? From season four. Fifi. I want Fifi. Ew, really? I want to see Jiggly. I actually thought Jiggly as like a first alternate. I would like to see Jiggly. I would love to see Willem, but rumor has it is they've not contacted Willem. Wasn't Willem. Contacted. Willem doesn't play well with others. And they, they, that's why they didn't invite him to the crew. Willem's been blacklisted from all things official drag race. So I would love for Willem to come back for All Stars and I know like everybody wants Willem. I don't think it'll happen. Willem's not gonna be on it. I voted, I would like to have Willem on there too and I would really love to see Dita. <gasps> oh, I love Dita yeah, Ritz. Dita. Um, and it, she's Dita. really severely improved her drag since she's been on the show. Um, I think my first alternate though would be the princess. Princess, Jiggly, Fifi, any of them would be fine with me. Who I do not want to see from that season. Madame Laqueur. I do not want to see Madame Laqueur. <laughs> and I do not want to see Kenya Michaels. I am sorry. I wonder if they will bring any of the trans girls onto the show. I'm very curious about that. I feel like Carmen's probably been blacklisted too. Carmen so has definitely been blacklisted. I don't think her, Carmen will be on it. For her hate speech against RuPaul. Who else, who else has transitioned? Um, Sonique. Sonique. Although Carmen, I would. Kenya. I would. Gag to see Sony and Monica. Monica was the other trans oh, yeah, girl Monica. that's been on the show. Um, but yeah, I would. I Jiggly for sure. I want to see Jiggly from season five. I do not want. I, Roxy. I don't. I would not want to see Roxy up there. Alaska. I want Alaska to come back. The rumor is that she has confirmed that she's going to be on it. I, I. She needs to be there. My vote was for Penny because I feel like Penny was oh. robbed. My other vote was for Alyssa. Oh, Alyssa Lisa. needs to be on that show, but somebody said there's scheduling conflicts, so they're rumoring that she's not going to be on it. I would live for Alyssa on that show. She's the breakout star of that season, so if she's yeah. not on it, it would be a farce. Farce um, the tea. And detox. Oh, yeah, Lasky and detox, for sure. For sure. From season six. Can we just have Bianca come back and slay them all? <laughs> I would not mind if... Adora came back. I feel like, mm. I feel like if they're gonna ask anybody from season six, I feel like they're gonna ask Adora because she's, she is a walking gift bag of she's TV goodies. She's very, very busy though. She is busy, but I mean, it's a TV appearance and smart bitch shouldn't turn down TV appearances. I would love if, um, keep it foxy. Oh, Jocelyn. I would love if Jocelyn came back. Actually, I wouldn't mind if Gia came back. Absolutely. Absolutely. Mm -mm. I wouldn't mind. My vote was for April because oh, April, April fucking needs to be on that. She even yes. said at the reunion that she wasn't meant to win season six. She was meant to win All Stars two. Yeah. I think that Dela was robbed blind. Oh my god. Yes, Dela. Oh my god. How did you forget about Dela? Dela needs to be on it. I, no question. Dela needs to be on it because Dela is one of those queens who I feel like she won without winning. Dela you know really I mean? did. Y you know what? If you. Dayla she didn't need to win. I think Trinity should be on the show. Oh yes, Trinity, Trinity really is wants so to be on the show. So fierce. Like somebody reblogged a gift set of her runways from the show, and I just I forgot how beautiful Trinity is. Like she really. She's probably. I, sorry about it. I think she's one of the prettiest queens that's ever been on that runway. The rumor is that Lagan is going to be on it because she is unavailable for bookings during September, but that may be that she's keeping her schedule open because. Willem was supposed to be on All Stars 1, and then last minute was told that he wasn't going to be. So it's very possible that they told a whole bunch of queens, like, keep your schedule open because yeah. we're going to let you know. And so they just were like, okay, I'm going to take, you know, the first f three weeks off of the month, cross my fingers and hope that I get this, and if I don't, I'll just pick up gigs where I can. Okay, from season seven. The rumor is that Ginger Minge is going to be on it because she cleared out her schedule, like, randomly for September. Which is when the filming's supposed to start. Let's let her. 
I, I, I could go for a little minge. She may be the second coming of Chad Michaels, where people feel like Violet didn't deserve it, even though Violet totally did. Yeah. You can't win. How many did she win? Three challenges or four? She won Plenty. three. Plenty. Violet won. Darling. You can't win three challenges and never lip sync once and not win. Like, that is just completely unfair. It's like Sharon winning four challenges and then not winning. Like, it's just not fair. And Chad, I think, only won a challenge or maybe two. Like, it's, it's just not fair to be like Violet didn't deserve it. Yes, Ginger's a great queen, but Violet deserved it. I think, More. I think people say Violet didn't deserve it because she doesn't have the history. Mm. I would love it if Ginger came back. I want uh, Katya and Trixie. I want Katya and Trixie back. The rumors that both Bring of them are back coming. Trixie. <laughs> Again. Justice for Trixie. Justice for Trixie. Again. Again. Like more. with Shangela, third time's a charm. This would be both, if they brought them back, this would both be both of their third times back in that workroom. Uh, definitely Katya. Although I don't know if she will survive another round of filming Drag Race. Poor dear. It'll only be a couple um, weeks. Couple, if, she can, if she can hack it, then all for her. If she... But if Katya, if they ask Katya and she says no, I will not be upset about it because mm. I know just from her Katya's personal vlogs, she is a winner. She's like Raven. Herself. She didn't need to win to be a winner. To be a winner. Um, but I also know, like, just from her her you know diary entries in during the show, the untucks and stuff she said afterwards. Filming Drag Race was very hard for her. It was very mm -hmm. emotionally, mentally, physically taxing for her. So, she couldn't even drink. And she couldn't even drink her way through it. I personally would be very disappointed if Trixie doesn't show up again. Trixie has to, though. They have to. She, she was... She was tied for congeniality. Yeah, and she was And she was a, telling people to vote for, for Katya because she felt Katya deserved it more. And she was such a well-received queen that season. And a season where not many were. Uh, <laughs> her drag is so different. And her drag is so fantastic. So hopefully they bring her back. I feel like they'll probably bring somebody back like Tempest. I, I actually put fine. Tempest on my list. I really would be okay with Tempest. I would also really be okay with Kasha. Oh, I yeah. live for Miss no. Kasha Davis so much. I would really gag, and I was mentioning this to Jesse, if they brought back like previous winners, like if they brought like the only two Tyra I would be okay and with BB. Would be BB and Tyra, because they literally won a nickel and a boot. I would be more okay with BB. I feel like that would be just something shady enough that might happen. Like they'd be like, the last girl in would be like would be BB would or be Tyra BB or Tyra or like Sharon Needles would come walking in. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. We will see you all again some other time. Let us know what your thoughts are in the comments below. Bing. Bye. Bye.